Hello guys, I'm just gonna give you a short video today to show this um, sim very simple, well, it's pretty simple, pumpkin farm, auto pumpkin farm. Um, no maintenance required. Basically, it just outputs pumpkins to this chest and it uses a block breaker to break the pumpkins, but it only, it only, um, it doesn't cause any lag. That's another thing about this design. No lag because there's no moving parts. Um, like nothing needs to update. Um, see, no, none of the redstone's moving. Basically what happens is when a pumpkin grows, see, the only possible spot for a pumpkin to grow is right here next to the block breaker. And what happens is this redstone repeater, it, it's trying to reach this wire, but it can't. But when a pumpkin grows, the pumpkin kind of acts as a conductor. And it'll get the signal across and it'll activate the block breaker therefore breaking the pumpkin so if I let me get a let me get a block to demonstrate what happens when a pumpkin grows it would be right here and it's just instantly broken and placed into the chest so um, pumpkins um, you can use them to produce methane, which can, which can be used in a gas turbine to produce energy. So that's the reason why I wanted to make a pumpkin farm. But not like we need energy now, because we got um, a crazy big tree farm running for charcoal. But uh, this is another option for energy production. If you wanted to use pumpkins to produce methane in, in industrial centrifuge, you can, you can produce methane from pumpkins. But... Uh, yeah, so basically the design, I don't know, there might be a way to make this more compact, but this is how it works. Um, you got a redstone torch, redstone repeater facing away from the torch, and then, um, you know, just kind of copy this. This is just redstone wire and, uh, block breakers, which are very easy to make. You just need a piston. Um, that's the important, that's the main part of it, at least. And then it just kind of repeats itself. Another redstone repeater, remember the, the torches are here to um, power the repeaters and the repeaters are facing away from the torches. And it just repeats that. And this is pneumatic tube because uh, that's what these block breakers can output to. They can either output to a chest or pneumatic tube, but they can't output to like wooden transport pipes or whatever. So you have to use this tube if you want to have a bunch of them set up. And that's it. You just put the tube here and it'll just pump them all into the the output that it detects wherever you put it. Um, I haven't had any problems with these actually dying after a certain number of pumpkins produced. But they will die if you uh, let me, if you jump on them. Or if any other mob jumps on them. So you want to maybe set up a fence or maybe just do this indoors, you know? So it's up to you how you want to handle that, but I haven't handled it yet. So, but I, I don't think we'll have much problem because it's kind of well lit. Unless there's a cow that comes in, you know. Uh, yeah. So hope you guys find that useful. Uh, I'll see you guys next time.